Um, you know, Jesus, I think, is the Son of God. He's the Saviour of the world. I'm not really sure who Jesus is. Um, I personally think Jesus is more a symbol than a person, something that unites people. Um, well, I personally think that Jesus is the Son of God and that he came down to earth and died on the cross to take all our sins away so that we can have eternal life. That's what I think Jesus is. Jesus is the light of the world, uh, the saviour of all humanity and also the redeemer of all the world. Son of God. The Son of God, that's there what I was going to say. Yeah. Yeah. Jesus is the only reliable person, the only person I can always come to. Jesus was a man who lived a few thousand years ago. I think Jesus was uh, was an extremely influential leader. Um, I think he was a leader who said something different in a time when people needed uh, need leadership. I genuinely have no clue. Um... <laughs> I genuinely could not tell you. I guess Jesus is a man who lived hundreds of thousands, what, thousands of years ago? Yeah, thousands of years ago, and has become like a figure for many. Um, but for others, he's just uh, an inspirational guy for other reasons. A role model. Christian guy, I suppose. Not for me. Um, pretty German for the Christians, though, I suppose. Pretty cracking lad for them. But probably won't see him in Clue anytime soon. If he came down and actually spoke to me, or if there was some artifacts that we could look at of proof of how he walked on water or something like that. I guess I'd have to witness like a massive miracle or something that just couldn't be explained, but yeah. <laughs> and so for me to believe that Jesus was the Son of God, I'd first have to believe in, in God, or more specifically the Christian God. Um, maybe if I saw him in Clue, <laughs> um, <laughs> or he just turned up to me and said like, if he came up to me and he was, here's some bacon, I'd be pretty chuffed because I really miss bacon here.